it's very important that with every game you learn something new and um, you know with learning you get better and as a team if we cannot work together and, and rely on individual brilliance it does not really help the team and obviously as a technical team if we had um, probably a, a better game approach um, tactical wise it would have been much much helpful because I think our biggest downfall was that um, we did not have a game plan, we did not ha- know how to approach the game, we only we always played at you know with one pace throughout the entire game of which it exhausted us and by the time we have to finish up the game or wrap up the game we can't because we're just playing with one pace if we can you know be able to stage ourselves and phase ourselves throughout the game and that um, also means that we need to be matured with our game as we play. Well obviously it was a very uh, tough experience for us and you know as rookies in the tournament um, we just went out there really ambitious wanting to prove everyone wrong that we couldn't make it and you know I think we kind of get we kind of got ahead of ourselves um, because we're just so excited but obviously um, I felt that we kind of got better and better with every game that we played but it was just unfortunate that we woke up very late at the stage of the tournament of which it was so um, I feel that we, we learned a lot as well um, so it will give us a good enough time for us to prepare for, for the AWC but uh, we're just hoping that the experiences that we, we acquired from the Olympic Games will be very beneficial in the upcoming games. Uh, women's football in South Africa, you know, it, it needs to you know, start uh, growing and it's growing at a very steady pace. And I feel that if we had probably had a, a, a greater performance or a better performance in the Olympic Games, we'd be talking something new.